All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the empire, welcome back to, uh, my, I was about to say Mass Effect, to Mafia Definitive Edition. I haven't played a Mass Effect game in a minute. Um, last we left, we were here at this church, about ready to cause some more trouble after escaping a bunch of cops. So let's, uh, let's just hide out or sneak around. Jesus, how many stairs? Okay, we're almost at the bottom. Nope, don't run. Crouch. No matter how far we've fallen, we can find redemption in death. Now, William, he was a sinner, yes, but he was also a loving son, a protective brother, and a loyal friend. And for those virtues, we pray that his soul will find salvation. And now I believe one of Billy's closest and dearest friends would like to say a few words. Thank you, Father. I, uh... I just wanted to pay my respects. Billy, I never said this, but... I consider you my brother. I can't even count all the times you saved my ass from a beat. So I don't know how I'm good. What are you doing? Wait, that's the guy. That's the guy who killed Billy. God damn it. Why would the priest say something? That's unprofessional, dude. It's a funeral. We'll take the time to get the comic too. Who else is shooting? They're up there. Time to move, time to move. Okay. Shit, shit. Somebody's up there. Days ago. I need somebody to pop out, please. He's dead. Load. Where'd he go? Reload. Reload. You think I'm enjoying this? Switch it up. What have you done? Murder in the house of God. These men were criminals, father. Thieves. Rapists. Killers. And God would have embraced them if they'd asked for forgiveness. Now, which one of these men might have sought redemption by working with the poor? Which one might have saved just one life? None of us, father. You bastard. If you have any confessions to make, you better do it quick. No more bloodshed, please! I'm sorry, Father. <sighs> Consider this an act of divine retribution. <sighs> that make us even? Sure. For now. For your trouble, Father. I don't want your blood money. 
You took theirs. Not a lot of difference from where I'm standing. That should be enough dough to patch up the bullet holes and keep you quiet. <laughs> when the cops come, you tell them the gunman who did this had East Coast accents. Must have been from out of town, right? I won't lie. But I won't say anything at all. Good. Be a shame if we had to come back here. Where the hell were you? As soon as I walked into church, the crew recognized me. Followed me straight back out. Where are they now? The same place as all these guys. Come on. We gotta go. Alright, sounds good. Didn't, uh... Didn't seem to go well for you. Didn't go too well for me either. We gotta, we gotta thin them out a little bit. Time to move. Get in, Sam. Why is this car smoking? Quick, quick, quick! Suspect in a cult is escaping in a hearse. I repeat, a hearse. We're not doing that because the car is not started. All right. Everybody out! Everybody out! Sam? Sam? What you shooting? Get in the car! Well, today didn't turn out like I expected. Didn't turn out like anybody did. Whatever you did at the cat house got the cops plenty pissed. Yeah, yeah. it was messy, but I got everything done. Everything? Yeah. Everything. I don't know why you're saying whatever I did, you were there when it was explained. I basically did exactly that, except I saved Michelle. They given up yet? I don't think so. They must have called out every cop in the city. Coming up on a point where we can lose them. Or lose one of them. Oh dear lord. Ooh. Oh no, didn't make that. Come on, lose them. I'm trying. Okay, we put them off to us for a little bit. Okay, they're gonna be looking at North Park. And they've still reported that we were in a hearse, so maybe they're not gonna expect a cop vehicle. There's a cop car there, we're gonna keep moving forward to go around. Go back to patrols. We'll get him next time. Okay. We lost them. Thank Christ. Gonna be trying to forget today for a long time. You're telling me. Let's get back to the bar. We gotta lie low. The way this all went down, we gotta lie low for weeks. Ah, the priest will keep his trap shut. Don't worry. Morello got a bloody nose, and you and Polly are in the clear for whacking Galati's son. Boss will be pleased. All right, sounds good, sounds good. 
probably might have to lie low for more than a week. A couple of months, maybe a year. I mean, you, you bombed a hotel and then shot up a church. That happening nowadays, you get Burger King when you're driven to the police station, but back then, they ain't gonna forget that. my time was up it's not anything you wouldn't do for me I know but when you come that close to biting it Christ it's something don't need to tell me about that just don't think about it best lesson I could ever teach you don't think about anything okay intermezzo <laughs> Jesus Christ, Tommy. You're confessing to a shootout in a church. And I ain't even through the hard stuff yet. You know I could take you in right now, put your bowling bars, tell you old and gray. Maybe. If you think you can make any of it stick. But then you'd never know about Morello. Hey, fellas. Sorry to keep you waiting. My shift just started. What you having? Two lunch specials, please. And more coffee. You know what? Let's bring the whole pot. All right, we've come this far together. What kind of heat did you get from the church? It's a strange thing. Nothing really came of it all. Always figured Celieri paid off someone somewhere because it wasn't even in the papers. We just had to lay low for seven, eight months. The cops kept showing up at the bar just to remind us they were watching. And Frank caught wind that Morello was helping Galati get reelected, hoping he'd go after the Don. Well, I recovered some account books from Rella's offices. 33 was a pretty good year for him. Best in the world bleeding out before we did. While we were busy keeping our heads down, he started moving in on our rackets. Quiet at first, a few trucks go missing. Uh, top burner has one too many highballs, drives off a bridge. One of our regular pickups suddenly closes up shop, moves upstate. You need it and catch on? Not me. I think maybe Polly smelled something. But even with the cops looking over our shoulders and Morello circling, we were still making good money. And with the Dom worried about keeping the heat off, we didn't have much to do, except drink, have a few laughs. And every time I went into Celieri's, there was Sarah. So it was a good year. Until Frank. A Coletti, a Don's consigliere. Yeah, that's right. He set me straight. He set us all straight. There's a lot of buzz around town about you guys. Yeah, we got into a little scrap last night. It's no big deal. I don't care about the bar fight, Tom. I care how it looks when you walk into a club and buy everyone around. Uh, we gotta do something with that, though. <laughs> then blow it at the track on Sunday. Or take a dame to a show. Or invest it, for Christ's sake. <laughs> you want me to become one of those Wall Street boys? <laughs> don't sass me, Tommy. I'm trying to teach you the ropes, so you don't get strangled by them. You ever have a dog, Tom? Sure. A little mutt when I was a kid. When I was eight or nine, before I came over from the Sicily, I had this beautiful, skinny Cherneco de Letna. Like a little greyhound. Fastest dog you've ever seen. That's how I met the Don. We started setting up races together. Betty on her with coins and rifle shells. There wasn't another dog that could catch her. She never lost. Until the day she did. We were only out of pocket knife, but I never saw the Don so angry. She got old on you? No. Pregnant. She went into heat, got out of the yard, and every dog in town had a turn. You're like that dog, Tommy. Every time you flash your money around, you're a bitch in heat. And everyone in that club is now looking to fuck you. 
And once you get fucked, you're no good to us. Do you understand? Uh, you made your point. Good. Because you need to think about your career here. Look, Paul is at his ceiling. He's the guy we want in a tussle, but he's not smart enough to run anything. Sam is loyal, but he has no vision. But you, Tommy, you could run this town someday. Well, I appreciate that, Frank. So, uh, what happened to the dog? The Don tried to drown her. I broke his nose. You can let me off here. Give Sarah my best, Tommy. Holy shit, that was intense. Also a metaphor I wouldn't have thought about for flashing around your money. <laughs> Trip to the country, 33. Back then, everything went through Frank. The plans, the orders, the money. You could get the call day or night. Ah, Tommy. Frank says to wait for him in the garage out in the back, eh? You got the job, I think. Thanks, Sounds good. Luigi. Sarah's cooking. She's bringing something over. In this rain? <laughs> She's a good girl. I'll see you tomorrow, Luigi. Okay, kitchen's down. Everybody's going yeah. home. Sure. Back in the day, when the boss was still with that phone, we got called out to a hit. Some, uh, politician on the take Christ. thanks for waiting Tom the Don and I had to go over last month's numbers again sure so what's the job I want you to help Sam and Polly with the shipping we've got coming in tonight Good stuff. Straight from Canada. Where do you need me? Sam's gone to meet our friends from the north at a farm outside of town. Polly will oversee the trucks bringing the shipment into the city, but I want you to go with him. Be an extra pair of eyes. Make sure it all goes smoothly. Okay. Get the car from Ralphie and meet Polly at the warehouse. He's got heaters in case you run into any trouble. Sure, Frank. No problem. Good. Now bring the Canadian home safe, Tommy. There is already a case you're marked for the done. All right, got another job. Let's uh, let's meet up with Vinny for a second. I don't actually know what weapons I have on me, if any at all. Thanks, Ralph. Old man's asleep. Eleven, and that's about it. So we're gonna pick up the pick up the knife. There you go, and the shotgun for safekeeping. Sleep tight, Vin. <laughs> He's passed out. Jesus. person here. Acceleration, parking grip.
570 a. Let's just turn that off. Don't need any copyright up in here. Always raining lately, e even in real life. The past week it's been raining and drenching everything. It doesn't seem like it's stopped. It doesn't seem like it's really gonna stop either. Oh, it's got a normal horn. This is what happens when you live in an area with normally volatile weather and then you combine it with climate change. So. Mm. Okay. Cops block this off. Because there's a car on fire, I think. Hey now, calm down. I didn't do anything. So we're meeting Paulie and Sam out in the warehouse, which is where all the way out in the country. This game is just beautiful. It's gorgeous. I wonder if they, um, I wonder if they, they probably didn't straight up remake Mafia 2. Cause, um, cause it was a PS3 era game instead of an early PS3 slash PS2 era game like this one. Like, I think this originally came out in 02, maybe? So they probably just remastered it since 2 came out in 2010. But if they did remake it, I'd, I'd love to see how good it looks. the needle oh, we're meeting him here okay come on Tom Watch it, pal. Just dry it out. Sorry. Real high sprung there, Polly? Oh, uh, yeah. We've done a few pickups at the farm before. Don't worry. There ain't nothing but cow shit and shine out here. It's gonna be an easy few clams. Boys will load up the trucks. We'll come straight back. Yeah, let's make it quick. I got some place to be. Ah, uh, you see it sooner or later. Luigi's little girl, your night shift. <laughs> You're something else, pal. Protecting the girl's virginity one day and taking it the next. Lay off, Polly. Ah, oh, come on. I'm just kidding. She's a good girl. You settle down, she'll straighten you right out. You're going home to a couch. <laughs> Now, I wonder what kind of story she could tell about her old man, though. Luigi was a stone-cold killer back in the day. I wouldn't know. You know she's been helping out behind the bar since she was a kid. I bet she's seen and heard a few things. Probably knows more about our business than we do. She knows enough not to ask me too many questions. That's good. She won't ever make a liar out of you. Christ. You ought to marry her just for that. God damn it. Sam should be waiting here, but I don't see him. Something smells off. Don't let your Pekka get all shriveled up. Probably just trying to get out of the rain. Or into the bootleg. <laughs> That'll wake him. He ain't coming. Okay. 
Let's go find them. This don't sit right. That bastard is just three sheets, and I'm wrecking a new suit for nothing. I swear I'm gonna kill him. Here, just in case Frank was right. I'm gonna go grab them boys, get them sorted out. You go ahead, see what's what. We'll catch up with you. All right, let's go find Sam. Jeez, it's pouring down here. Someone's been waiting here tonight. One quarter out of work, damn. We're just watching the depression progress. Radio's off chair overturned but there's not much going on the guy we pay to keep this place in check don't even pretend to farm now this don't feel right X in the post and the turned over chair Missing farmer Harry Smith, missing for two months, was confirmed dead today by Lost Heaven County Co Coroner Office. A fruitless search led to the farmer's father and neighbors uh, ended several weeks ago. Grizzly dis the grizzly discovery of the body was made by local children looking for edible mushrooms and berries in the woodland of the local cops farm. Oh shit. What kind of guy shoots a dog? Place is derelict. You gotta be careful. Somebody shot that dog, so something's obviously going on. It's a torrential downpour over here. Where the hell are you hiding? Let's check this part of the barn, or not barn, but storehouse first. There's the Canadian whiskey. Health. Open crate of whiskey. Hey, buddy. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Jesus. Drop. Your weapon. You first. We don't have time for this. Sorry, pal. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Okay, then. Get over here! I got him pinned down! Shit. Get some cover! Really, the moonshine battle saved you? For like half a second? This will uh, give you something to think about. Do I have Molotovs on me? I do not. I just have the slot. Not here. What the hell would I be looking for in the barrel? Wow! It's me, Tom. Polly. What took you so long? Looking for Sammy? Did you find him? Nah, not yet. Just him. <laughs> Canadian crew. Dollars to donuts to rest the face down in the dirt, too. <sighs> oh, Christ. Fuck. Cops, Tommy. 
Well, how would I know? They didn't show a badge. God, they didn't say anything. They must be in Morello's pocket. This bastard. He can't even let us have this one racket. Forget about it, Tom. We gotta find Sam and get out of here. Border Patrol. Fuck, man. These guys are the real deal. They gotta be cops from the Border Patrol. Fuck. They've come heavy, all right. Make Lost Heaven PD look like pussycats. That house looks closed up. So does that. Or maybe not. Can we go in here? Can, but nothing's here. <coughs> Let's check in here. Oh, fuck. Don't rush ahead, man. Jesus. Jesus Christ. Looks like we found the Canadians. You see Sam in there? No. <sighs> like some. So another one. But not Sam. Okay, got two Molotovs. Canadian passport. Checking here. There we go. I always forget to fight. Okay. God, that music's still going. Is there somebody else? Yep, yep, definitely. Water caps down Morello's dirty work. Other side of this wall. There we go. Outside we go. Sneaking around, Polly. Shoot somebody. Let's take this. We're still fighting outside. Where's Sam? Shit! Come on, fellas! Let's
Oh, got one. Who's next? Andiamo, bastardi! Ecco! Stay here and watch our backs. Plug anyone who gets within a hundred yards. Except us. Okay, okay, just hang on. I'll go get the truck, then we'll take you to the doctor. Hey, hey, you're gonna make it, Sam. Tommy, you got you, buddy. stay here with him. I'll be back, I'll be back in a flash. All right. Okay. survived worse. Sure. Sure we are. Ah, damn it. Where'd all these guys come from? Well, see you. I'm almost out of ammo. There you go, buddy. Saw you move. Relax, buddy. I'm coming. I'm coming. Jesus Christ! Ugh. Where's the goddamn truck? Only should be coming. Crap, oh, God. on fire don't want any of them coming through that way or not just run through the fire like a badass How's Sam? Well, he ain't any worse. I'll go get him. Keep an eye out. Come on, Al. <laughs> <Come on, laughs> <Al. laughs> I need the doctor. 
the volley. Yeah, I can see that here because hang on. He ain't doing too good. Come on. Okay. Get him up there. Okay, okay. Hey, I'm gonna get y'all patched up. Okay? What the fuck? Polly? We got more company. All right, get in. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'm right here, Steve. There's some ammo and a Thompson back there somewhere. When they pull in behind you, blast them down. Got it. Just don't let them get past us. Just get us the fuck out of here, to, uh, Pauly. That thing back there is huge! Where the hell did they find that truck? Police militarization! Hold her steady! Take him out, Cap! Let him have it! What the hell do you think I'm doing? Aim for the driver. On. Let it reload. Holy bastard! My pedal is to the metal! Oh god. Did we lose them? Not likely. Two squad cars on us! Aim for the, either the driver or the engine. Got to get them behind us so I can take them out. Okay, one down. Get us out of here. I'm trying to do. Keep her steady. But it has small guns.
Thank you, Sammy. And another! Throw another! Holy shit! We did it! We did it! Okay, we're here, tell him! You can see him out! I'm gonna go wake up the doc! Sam! Sam! We made it! We're at the doctor's house! Paulie, what the hell are you doing here so late? Uh, uh, evening, Doc. Sorry to wake you, but um, we had a little accident. We got an injured man out here. All right, bring him inside. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, I'll stay with Sam. You can take the truck back. Call it a night. No, I'll wait. <laughs> Doc's already got his hands full. No sense in both of us breathing down his neck. Go on, Doc. I'm gonna be fine. Okay. Hey. You did it tonight. Jesus Christ, man. This was stuck in the driveway? That's a hell of a night to try to sleep off. Let's go see our girl, though. She'll help Tommy uh, put it behind him. Stop honking at me, fool! Is it just me or is it he raining heavier now? I don't know. Maybe it just looks denser. Shouldn't be too far. I love the way the light reflects off the water. It's not something you see in games a lot, but it looks amazing.
here. Is everything safe and sound? Looks like it. cold. Well, that was sweet as hell. All right, though, ladies and gentlemen, I thank you so much for watching. Uh, when we return, we're going to see what else is next for us. Uh, but until then, I thank you so much. If you're on YouTube, like, comment, subscribe. On Twitch, drop me a follow. And I will see you all in a moment. Mm -hmm.